All right, everybody. Here's my trip from the um, Boca Chile yesterday. I really got some crazy looking stuff. My pet wood. Some crazy looking church. Some really crazy looking church. Um, some jelly beans. Some unknown stuff. More bigger chunks of church. Unknown stuff. Got some fossils, um, some coral. Got some crazy crowley. Probably about a rough count of about 40 of them. Yeah, there's some good ones in there too. And that big thing, I don't know what that is, if that's a crowley or not. I'm trying to figure it out. <clears throat> yeah, we'll take a look at a, a closer look at a few of them. Yeah, start off with some of the odd stuff. I have no idea what this is. Got to be a piece of a sort of a geode, I guess. I would imagine fossil, maybe. I don't know. This thing, never seen nothing like this out there before. Some little church, I think. Banded church. This one's cool. Pattern on this thing's crazy. This is kind of light, but cool. Looking. You got this thing. I have no idea whether that's pink and black, white, and a little pocket in it. Can y'all see that? Pink, black, and white. I have no clue. Never found anything like this before out there. But I like it. Oh, got a couple little fossils. This is a red one. Got some fossils in there somewhere. Yeah, you can see them. Yeah, that's a cool one. I like this one. Mm, that's the best one, I think. All right, this is a weird one. It's got pattern all over the place, all kind of crazy pattern on it. But it's a Crowley, I think. Definitely. And you got this broken one. The Matrix took like it got broken off of it, but it, I don't know. Pretty cool. This one's an odd color. And look at that pattern on that thing. Back ain't too good, but man, that's a nice looking rock. This is a cool looking one. It was covered in slime. I cleaned it a little bit, but I'm gonna have to clean it a little more. The um, section of the beach that's normally underwater, right now the beach is as low as it's ever been. I think it's almost at record level. I think it was 0.84 and 0.75 is um, the low record. So there's no water out there. And that was on the slime part there, but I, I probably could check that part too a little better. I know I'll find some in there. I thought when I found this, and I thought it was black and white, but it's really not. It's mostly white and a little off white and probably a little gray. But that's a cool looking one. It really is. I read this little bitty thing. This has pattern on the back of it. But it still stands out as a Crowley. This one, same thing, just a little pattern on top. This one's got a lot of pattern on it for a little bit of rock. That is cool. This one, probably Missouri egg, it's not a crawling. It's close though. Got a lot of pattern on it. Might slice it open, see what's on the inside. This one's got a little crystal pocket in it. Lots of, lots of batter, pattern on it. That is cool. Another little white one. There was a lot of white ones out there. And they're really hard to see. That's 
different pattern. I like it though. Miss Neil was just sitting like that. But it's a crown. It was a red one too. That's got a nice pattern. Let me clean this one. Let me clean this one off a little bit. Okay, yeah, I think I found this one up at the top of the beach. I don't know how it was so dirty. But, um, it's pretty cool for a broken one. That's not bad. And this little thing here, this is a beauty. It's too small. It's got that white border around it. Not that great a pattern on the back, but it's a crowley. That's a cool top on that. This one here has got tons of pattern on it. A little rock. All the way around. That's a cool one. Alright, this thing here is not a crowley, I don't think. It's got some agate like looking stuff on it. I might run it through the polisher, I mean, to the tumbler, and see if I could take a little bit of that off and see what it looks like underneath there, if it has any more pattern to it or not. But that's cool looking. I don't know what it is. It's cool. This one would have been an absolute beauty, but cracked in half. The pattern is crazy on it. And this is the same way. Look at the pattern on this thing. This is the one I found sitting like that. That would have been a beauty. Yeah. Wish we had the whole one there. This one here needs to be cleaned a little more, but it's a little crowley. This is one of my odd patterns, one of the most appealing look to it, but that's cool. I could have made the top 10 on some days, but not today. This one, cool looking. I like that. This is just an odd one here. Got pattern all over. Weird pattern, but it's pattern. <laughs> that is cool. Like it. Another one here, a little long one. It has some odd stuff out there, but that, that's got a great pattern on it. I like it. I never found that one just sitting there like that. And that's all there was to it basically. It's a little bit pattern. It's pattern on the side, but it, it's very light. Not a bad one though. I like it. Not an odd pattern. Nothing on the back. That's pretty cool. And this one. I don't know what to think about this thing here. I really don't have much color at all on it. But the pattern's there. It's definitely crawling. It's just light, light, light. I don't know what that is. <laughs> all right, we got so many crawlers out here right now. That's a bucket full from my trip to the gravel ball, I mean, to the landscaping rock. And that's a bag full from my other trip to the Slidell by uh, Landscaping Rocks. <laughs> so I got to get these videos done. I'm falling. I'm a little behind. All right. This is my top 10. Um, let me see. Maybe it's not in focus. All right. This is my top 10 slash 12. Couldn't make it down to 10. So, yeah, there's uh, 12 of them up there. And um, all pretty good rocks. Y'all see a favorite y'all like. See how it makes it to see if it makes it to the end. Alright, this will be number 12 here. This is um it's cool, it's just so light. I mean, but it's perfect really. It really is. Got a lot of matrix in one spot, but man, that is cool looking. I like it. This one's really cool. Just not um not a lot to it. I like it. But it's gonna be number eleven. Pretty cool rock though. This will be number ten. It's cool, but it's broken and it's small. But it's got some cracks on, it, but it's got a crazy pattern on it. 
I really like it. All right, this is gonna be number nine. Only because it's broken, this would be a way up there. I mean, this thing is, it's hard to even tell where it's broken, but it's got a couple of breaks in it. But man, this thing is gorgeous. It really is. I'm gonna have to polish this one, I think. Hopefully I can keep most of that color. Yeah, but that's cool. That's way cool. Number nine. This one here is just such an odd pattern. It had to be in the top 10. But it is cool, man. It really is. There's probably more pattern on the inside than the outside. So this one might get a little slice to it. I don't know. It's got enough room, I think. But it's cool looking. This one's going to be number seven. Really cool pattern. It's got a lot of holes in it. Couldn't cut this one. Might be able to polish it, but ain't about to cut it. That is cool. Loaded with color and pattern. This gonna be number six. Really cool rock. Color and pattern everywhere. I like that little spot right there. But it's cool. And it's got a nice bomb patrol to face on it. That is cool. I like that rock. <laughs> Alright, there's your top five. Is the rock still alive? One of them's not anymore. This one here is as cool as can be. It does have a break in it, but the color on this thing is incredible. It's got the yellow. It's either a smoky or a reddish color. It's hard to tell. It's kind of reddish, I think, or maroon. But man, that's a perfect little rock that wasn't broken. But that is cool. I like it. All right, number four. This might be the best looking rock of all of them, but it's just got so much of it with no pattern on it. You know, there's no pattern on half the rock. But the rock, the part that does have pattern is killer. I really like this rock, but I think we have to go with somebody else for find of the day just because of all this um, matrix looking stuff here. But man, this rock is killer. It definitely is. Alright. There's the three that's left. This is all that may surprise y'all, but in my opinion, this is just my opinion. I know somebody's going to be different on it, but um, this one here is cool. Definitely should be the find of the day. But it's got that broken corner. It's got two broken corners, actually. But man, this thing is cool. Man, it's killer. That's a cool rock. But not today. Man, look at the back on this thing. Is that one little broken spot? Got to be tough at this point. Now we got two left. I don't even know which way to go here. Well, I'm gonna go with this one for number two. I mean, it's got some. I've never seen this before. Where the agate face is totally different than the whole rock. It's actually, it's actually got like a crystal or uh, quartz face in there. So I don't know. That's that's a crazy looking rock. I've never seen that before. In the back, got normal, just normal looking pattern all around the back, and you get to the front, and I've never seen that before. But that's gonna be number two again. It's broken up a little bit. I uh, would like to see what it looked like before it got broke. That could have been a cool, cool rock. And we got number one. This thing's got pattern everywhere. And it's got a druzy face on the inside of it. That is cool. I don't know if y'all can see it. It's wet, but that's all shiny inside of there. That's a cool looking little rock. Maybe it don't deserve to be number one, but I think it does. Just for the pattern. That is cool. Nope. I'm getting close to... 800 still and like I said get get subscribed and make a few comments and you'll be in the drawing There'll be a few probably three of them. I'll be doing at 800. Thank y'all for watching like and subscribe